From the moment he met her at the start of grade two, Bryce just wanted Julie to leave him alone, give him some space. I heard her coming after me, but I just couldn't believe it. Maybe it just sounded like she was chasing me. Maybe she was really going the other way. But before I got up the nerve to look, she blasted right past me, grabbing my arm and yanking me along. This was too much. I planted myself and was about to tell her to get lost when the weirdest thing happened. I was making this big windmill motion to break away from her, but somehow on the downswing my hand wound up tangling into hers. I couldn't believe it. There I was, holding the mud monkey's hand. I tried to shake her off, but she just clamped on tight and yanked me along, saying, Come on! From the moment Julie had met Bryce, she'd flipped. She'd become a lunatic. I'd been in the moving van all of three minutes when his dad sent him off to help his mother unpack things inside the house. I chased Bryce all the way up the walkway, and that's when everything changed. You see, I caught up to him and grabbed his arm, trying to stop him so maybe we could play a little before he got trapped inside. And the next thing I know, he's holding my hand, looking right into my eyes. My heart stopped. It just stopped beating. And for the first time in my life, I had that feeling. You know, like the world is moving all around you, all beneath you, all inside you, and you're floating, floating in midair. Flipped by Wendell and Van Dran is a really cool story for those of you who are already comfortable reading chapter books. It's a story of two grade 8 students, Bryce and Juliana. The more Bryce gets to know Julie, the more he appreciates her passion, her her spirit, her sensitivity, the way she she stands up for what she believes in. The more Juliana gets to know Bryce, the more annoyed she is with how insensitive he is, how inconsiderate, how he says mean things without thinking of how they're going to hurt people's feelings. The chapters in Flipped switch the perspectives between the two characters. First, Bryce will tell the story as he sees it, relate the events from his perspective. In the following chapter, Julie takes her turn and will describe the same events from her perspective. Not surprisingly, their two versions rarely line up, and they rarely agree on who said what. So for those of you who like realistic stories, I recommend you try Flipped, a funny and touching story about two kids trying their best to negotiate the difficult waters of grade 8.